Protrex West here in Livermore, California, located at 889 East Airway Boulevard, just down the road from the uh, local airport. If you want to come buy something from us, we can definitely pick you up, no problem. Our website is www.protruxplus.com or you can reach us on the phone, 925-243-9000. We specialize in the full line of Lance overhead campers and Lance toy haulers. We also stock over 50 diesel and gas heavy duty trucks. Those half tons, three quarter tons, all the way up to one ton daily. We specialize in the Happy Jack tie down system and torque lift tie down. But today, we're going to show you how to load your Lance camper. Come follow me. Our service manager, Ruben Alba, can show us how to back in. Hi there. Once we have enough clearance, we're going to set this camper on this one side. this point you're going to want to plug in your Lance camper plug. This will be your running lights also to charge your onboard batteries. If you're short like me you might want to get a stepper stool. You're also going to want to verify that our left turn signal, right turn signal and running lights aren't working. What you can see here is the Happy Jack tie down system. This helps align up your truck camper. If you didn't have this application, it's perfectly fine. If we did the torque lift front and rear, we can add torque lifts front bumpers to pick up the empty space here that, that Happy Jack does. Either, either setup is okay. Let's verify the, the running lights first before we load the camera. Left turn. Good. Right. Good. Running. Good. Reverse. Good. Beautiful LED light, huh? From this point, I'm going to grab the remote ahead of time. Lance is a wireless output system. You're going to activate your jacks here. Put this in this nice little baggie. There's no cords to plug in, no nothing. Activate the jacks. The other applications for the slide outs, but today we're just going to do the jacks. Ruben has backed all the way in. Then we're going to release all the weight and put the camper on the truck. Five inches and one more inch. Stop. Good. Before we drop all this weight, I want you guys to take a look at the uh, forklift. Overload snubbers before and after your factory overloads would come right to the base of the torque lift So they'll take a, a little bit longer time to engage with this. This is going to alleviate the pressure off the airbags Normally without this you're going to probably have to run 80 to 90 psi With this application you're probably going to be a comfortable 50 maybe up to 65 psi with the torque lift overloads These also help out with your ride and sway Now we're going to drop all the weight we're going to retract all. Take a look at those snubbers. Camper is completely on the truck right now. We're gonna bring the jacks all the way up, maybe five inches before. Once we're done here, we're gonna 
take our swing out jacks and place them on the interior. travel you're gonna drop it in its normal riding position uh, we're gonna install the front struts and the front and rear torque clip tie down this Lance 1052 has the uh, ultra deck plus by torque clip so you got plenty of the exterior storage we store our cab over struts here and both the front and rear basket tie downs now these tie downs are individually marked so this is for the passenger side rear, and the other one's for the passenger side front. We can start with the front strut first. Make sure we have our little washers. I'm gonna push in this pin here. If you can chew up your nails like I did, then it'd be easier. Again, people, don't eat your nails. It's not good for you. There we go. already sized per corner so there's no more twisting you need to do. They are spring loaded. that come with them. Install the rear. You're done. Be a little bit tighter, but again, you're gonna want to mark per corner so you're not mixing them up. They're already sized for, for front and rear. So you never have to re-crank them again. Again, this is how to load your Lance Camper at ProTrucksPlus.com. We are open daily. Any questions, call us at 925-243-9000. You can email me personally at camperguy11 at gmail.com. Thanks for joining us and uh, hopefully we'll see you soon.